Paul, an easier interview this evening. What were your thoughts on that one? Must be pleased. Yeah, absolutely delighted. Absolutely delighted. So proud of the boys. Uh, we've challenged them from the start that our performances in the last few weeks, as we've spoken about consistently, have been poor. Uh, and tonight we had to make a lot of changes due to illnesses and injuries and all sorts. And, and tonight was just about go out and perform and can you get a performance that you can be proud of? Uh, and I feel that the players should be. Uh, their performance in the 90 minutes was, was first class. Uh, Crusaders have come into the game at the start of the second half and, and bossed the game for maybe 15 minutes or so there. Uh, we had to readapt and we had to manage the game uh, a little bit differently. But the players did that. They did that themselves and, and I'm so, so very proud of them. Um, Ricky again, absolutely outstanding. Um, and I'm sure you'll want to touch on the penalties, but he was first class from, from the first minute right to the end. Uh, and all the way through the team, I felt that we had that desire to just put a performance in. Um, I'm so proud of them for that. Coming off the back, obviously, of two poor performances that first half just seemed like we completely bossed the game. Was that the, was that the plan to just go out? Yeah, it, it was absolutely just go and perform the way you can. And I think the midfield three worked really, really hard together and they worked as a unit together. And, and that's what allowed us a platform perhaps maybe to play on. Um, I, I think we found good gaps in behind their fullbacks as well and, and the players could see that. Uh, and as a result, we've got two really early goals, uh, which we're absolutely delighted with. Um, yeah, we, we took the, the, the foot off the pedal a wee bit maybe in the second half, but again, I think that was part of Crusaders came out and they, they, they brought on a, a couple of changes and we had to manage that and the players had to find their way about that and they did that uh, with, with admirable quality. Uh, I'm really, really delighted with how well they did. So yeah, for, for me, it was just about work hard, work hard, work hard, and, and they did it. They did it. They did it by the bucket load. Second half, obviously, there was a, a penalty for the Crusaders. Did you see much of it from where, from where we were standing? It looked potentially a bit harsh. But yeah, you're not really supposed to ask me about those sorts of things. I, I didn't feel it was from where I was. Uh, I'm well prepared to look at the video again. Uh, the referee's closer than I am. Um, I, I was frustrated at times, and I said that to the fourth, that it felt like there were decisions going against us quite a bit. Um, but, you know, that's the emotion of the game. You get frustrated with it. I certainly didn't at the time feel that it was a penalty, but perhaps if I see it again, I'll, I'll see that it was and it's fair. And Listen, we can only go with what the, the referee gives, and, and that's what he gave, so we had to respond to it. Uh, and that's the big positive you take away from it. We could argue all night over whether it was or it wasn't, or whether this was right or that wasn't. The, the guys rallied round and, and they managed it, and, and they got themselves back into the game again. And to be honest, for me, I thought we looked the more likely to score in the last 10 minutes. Um, and we've gone to penalties and it's been fantastic, so yeah, again, delight. And just on the penalties, is that anything you've been working on or just...? Do you know, Ricky has just won the, the Player of the Month and it's so deserved. Uh, he has been fantastic. Uh, he's first at training every night. His attitude is unbelievable and you can see it in the pitch. He comes and he claims balls uh, and, and he is a, a young man with a wise head on his shoulders who bleeds confidence into our back four and everybody in front of him. Uh, and as a result of all of the work that they do, and, and Doc and, and Rob and, and the backroom staff there that work with them, I mean, they had been watching penalties and they, they were fit to tell Rick, he'll go this way, he'll go that way. And, and they got the most of them right, to be fair. And as you saw, Rick got his hand to a couple of others um, and, and he saved those. So absolutely delighted with his attitude, his endeavours, and, and he's just got his rewards. He's got his rewards tonight for, for his ability for the last month and he's got his rewards tonight for how well he played during the game. Just a quick one on uh, young Owen Taylor come on there, second half, he looked very dangerous. Owen has played a number of games now for the 20s, um, it's about trying to bleed him in, he's been training away, he's been working hard, uh, he scored four for the 20s a couple of weeks back and then he scored again this week. Uh, and again, as I said, you know we, we were almost forced into a number of changes this week um, and he's got his chance and wow, I think he's taken it really, really well. He stepped up as a young man and taken a penalty there as well. Uh, really delighted with that and I'm, I'm hoping there's a future there that you're going to see a bit of. Um, we've just heard Lauren is next in the semi-final. Thoughts? L Lauren away. Lauren away at the start of December. Um, yeah, listen, it didn't matter who it was going to be. It's a semi-final for the County Antrim Shield. It's a big game for this club uh, and we're looking forward to it. And, and listen, where we are at this point, Saturday is more important to me. I'm going to focus entirely and we've said that after the game to the players. It's done. We enjoy it. We celebrate it. We take the positives from it. but. But if we can't do the same stuff on Saturday, if we can't put the same level of work rate in, then we've got to ask ourselves questions. So we've got to go on Saturday now, we've got to work hard. We've got to go the following Saturday and work hard again because the league is more important to us. But yes, of course, we look forward to the Lauren game and when we get to that point, we'll do our, our due diligence and we'll make sure we go prepared. Well, well done tonight. Thank, Thank you. you very much.